also can you take us through the thank you good morning ladies and gentlemen we are going to read a joint statement by the Zimbabwe Defense Forces and the Security Services of Zimbabwe. We the, we, the Zimbabwe Defense Forces and the Security Services of Zimbabwe, wish to inform the nation that the situation in our country is returned to normalcy following the historic inauguration of His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Zimbabwe, Head of State and Government and Commander-in-Chief of the Zimbabwe Defense Forces, <coughs> Comrade Emerson Dambuzo Munangagwa, on 24 November 2017, which has actually set a new trajectory. We wish, therefore, to advise the nation that the Zimbabwe Republic Police is now assuming <coughs> its role as stipulated in the Constitution of Zimbabwe under Section 219, which among other things mandate the ZRP to maintain law and order, protect and secure the lives and property of the people. You still notice the ZDF and ZRP members conducting joint patrols, especially in the Harare Central Business District. We urge you all, progressive Zimbabweans, to respect the country's laws and cooperate with our officers as they perform their duties. I will now hand over to Ken Omukusi to read a part of the joint statement. As Zimbabwe Defense Forces, and security services. We play complementary roles in the defense and maintenance of law and order in our beloved country. We therefore remain committed to save our country. Zimbabwe is a peace-loving nation as demonstrated during the past week. We accordingly urge all citizens to remain committed to peace. We remain guided by His Excellency <coughs> President E. D. Munangagwa's inaugural speech particularly where he spoke about unity and self-discipline by all. Let us all remain united and peaceful and, and respectful of our national laws and bylaws as we uphold the rule of law. Law enforcement agents are already receiving reports of looting and illegal occupation of other people's properties, particularly farms and houses. This behavior is criminal and against the spirit of non vengeful retribution and will be met by the full wrath of the law. The Zimbabwe Republic Police would want to assure the nation that it will strive to ensure that all its operations and programs will be people-centered in accordance with the vision of His Excellency the President, Comrade Emerson Dabuzo Mnangawa. We would want to urge our nation to remain united and cooperate with security services as they discharge their duties. I thank you. 